is all about guttering. And the first thing we've got to do is go to Weeks's because if we don't, Simon will probably have some withdrawals. tell by this video but the whole stable is on a wonk like this so we've put a spirit level on it and we can line the guttering up just with the bottom of that board so that's what we're gonna do I might show you Simon's infinity pencil. I got it off Amazon and it's supposed to last forever. Instead of using the plumb line, what we're doing instead is just measuring up the width of a ruler and going from there. We're just going to follow the line of the shed instead with all its glory of bonus and slantedness forgot to say also we're spacing the brackets out one meter apart i know that's a bit close but you know what better to be safe than sorry the prevailing wind hits this side of the shed and we don't want anything moving blowing away disappearing etc etc
something like that. Okay. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Whoa. What's that? <laughs> Who needs a saw? Live act. IBC cover I've bought so far. I think it was like six ninety nine, seven pounds. It's not good. It's not very. Don't think it's very durable. Hmm. The best one was definitely the Amazon one, which I think was fourteen ninety nine. Hmm. Probably have to replace this one, but it's okay for now. It's okay for now. And the IBC has got these little, little. Uh, what are they called? Eye holes. Yeah. Yeah, and we're going to cable tie the downpipe to it for now until we with a better solution. cable tied it on we will figure out a better way more secure way to do that do you know what if you've got any suggestions then drop them in the comments below that would be great yeah but apart from that i reckon this is super got a new roof new guttering new ibc all plumbed in i think we're actually getting somewhere Cold, it's torrential rain, and we're down the yard. 
fixing the guttering because Simon couldn't sleep because he wasn't happy with the guttering. <sighs> you don't have to get wet as well. What are you doing, Simon? What are you doing? Just modifying this so that it uh, is a bit more secure rather than hanging out floating in midair. Okay. We've got to cut this down and we'll be good to go. It's just been raining non-stop. So we've just come down to high everything. But um had to go to Wixie's again on the way so that we could get some clips so that Simon could modify attaching the guttering to the side of the table. Oh, it's so cold. You haven't even got your workbench or anything? Yeah, that looks a lot better. Yeah? Yeah. Got a roofing screw. Temporary. <laughs> a temporary roofing screw. That'll do for now. Actually, that's probably a, the most waterproof screw you can get. <laughs> Yay! Oh, that's so much better. That's almost a lot more solid. Are you happy with that now? That'll do. Why is it leaking? Do you know what? I think it's running down from the outside. Where's that coming from? No idea. Everything is solid. There's water coming through, yeah, not much. Yeah, it's not going through here. More haste than less speed. So that will go on that way around. Yeah. And that into that. And that's the right way around, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. It's got the one point five point four miles. Yeah. Yeah, let's have a look if it's running in. Yeah, it's running in there. That's running a lot. Is it straight now? Yeah. This uh piece of wood. Mm, yep. Better, better. No leaks. Going out perfectly. Oh, hey! Perfect. And it's sealed. Yay! There we go. <laughs> it was leaking. We didn't know why it was leaking. And it was just that the one joint was on upside down. You learn things every day. <laughs>